Thanks, Rob. And half a million people came out for the annual Pride Parade in downtown Columbus. Nearly 13,000 people participated, up 5,000 from last year. NBC4's Danielle Grossman was at the parade along with the rest of the NBC4 team. And she gives us an inside look. Mother Nature gave Columbus a gift and the rain held out for a few hours just in time for Pride Parade 2019 and people came out in the thousands. Young, old, men, women, dogs, everyone came out to support the LGBTQ community in Columbus, including Susan Knorr. Columbus rocks. Susan's been riding in Pride for over two decades. This is such a beautiful event. I mean, this is, this is about love and equality and being treated right and just being able to be myself. And this year was one for the books. Each year the parade grows more and more. It's a wonderful example on why Central Ohio is such a great place. Rick Harrison helps organize the parade and is in awe of how far the city's come over the years. The first year they held the parade, uh, people had bags over their heads. It was a block long. We didn't see the kind of support that we have. The support for people like Blaze Yeager, a transgender man who says it wasn't until recently that he felt comfortable in his own skin. It's amazing that people can come together for such a thing that America has been against for so long. And we're, we've come so far, we got a long way to go, but we're getting there step by step. And each step taken in this Pride Parade symbolizes just how much closer we are to full acceptance here in Columbus, but also across the nation. Parade organizers hope next year is even better and bigger, but Pride 2019 was a major success. Local for you in Short North, Danielle Grossman, NBC4.